What's up everybody? Today is the day. We're gonna pick up the MR2 from Cleveland. I'm gonna show you guys a new project car. Let's get to it. Alright, you guys may have seen this on my Instagram. We got a 94 Del Sol. Gonna make it a fun little project car. This thing was pretty cheap and it has no rust on the quarters, which is what I was looking for. Basically, every dust hole around here has rust on it, but this one looks like it has none that I've seen, so looks good. It does have hail damage. You can see that. Look at that. But I'm not too worried about that stuff. Interior is pretty clean. Does need some door panels. They got some aftermarket speakers in there that need to come out. But it's just little sh little stuff that I can get fixed up no time. See the hail damage here. Look at that. So need a windshield. It's pretty bad. But it was a really really good deal. It's got uh, D2 coilovers. Um, it's got the LS mesh wheels. It's got some. Black work racing uh, rear low control arms, a Beaks tie bar. So, I mean, they put some work into it. The back of it. It's got a God Snow exhaust, full exhaust. Never heard of it, but it doesn't sound bad. Here's the tie bar, suspension. Underneath is pretty clean. And check this out. Let me open the hood. Comes with a full LS swap. But it has a knock. But you know me, we're going to make this thing kind of fast, and that is definitely coming out. We're going to keep it all motor though, just have a fun little car, I can drive around, beat on, go race, while the MR2 is getting done. But I got some goodies over here that's going to be going on it. We got this 3 inch intake from uh, the J-Swap that I bought, I'm going to modify that. We got a manual power steering rack, new tie rod ends, got some camber for the rear. These are front lower control arms. For the, got a camber kit for the front. Just some nice stuff that's going to be going on here. Some stuff I got going on around here. Uh, let's see here. The EK hatch is sold to my buddy Thomas. So once he gets his house, I told him he could leave it here. Once he gets his house, he's taking it home. We got a that MR2 that you see on my Instagram, the the newer style, the MRS. It's getting a low, very low mileage. It has like 52,000 miles. One uh, ZZ. It's got some new seats. Got an exhaust. We got a new top for it. All that was pretty much a package deal. I got the. The bike, I got a new uh, spark plug, new gas in it. Uh, it only starts with brake clean though, so I'm thinking the carburetor is all gummed up from the old gas that Chad just let sit in there. He's been sitting for about six, seven months, so you can't let that with a carburetor set up. You can't do that. Uh, what else? Like I said before, we're going to get the prelude fixed. Um, then we got. The Del Sol getting done. Then we have the 240. Uh, bring that back up and Ellis swapping that for Chad. And then uh, it's going to be basically just doing the MR2. Enjoying the Del Sol, doing the MR2. And just taking it easy for a little while. So that's what we got coming up in the near future.
All right, guys, we made it here to higher standards. Got to get out of the truck, go find Jared. Ryan should be here any minute, I think. Go check out the cars. Load up the MR2. Let's do it. Look who I found. What, man? <laughs> Ryan. For hey, this. Ryan. You better edit that. Here's the MR2. <laughs> but we're not going to look at this yet. We're going to go in back. What? Check out Ryan's stuff. We got nothing here. There's nothing to see. Jared. <laughs> Hi, Jared. What's up? All right, come on. Let's go. Take me back there, Ryan. Go ahead, Jared. This is let's your go. place, man. No, go ahead. We might need some light back there, but I'll it's all right. You. We'll get some light. Ain't nothing to see here. Ryan's made some upgrades. No. Nah. No? The upgrade ain't here. Oh. But you'll see that soon. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, shit. The engine's out. Last time we seen it, the engine was in. <laughs> what happened, Ryan? Well, what's that? Why don't you go ahead and explain what that? What had happened was, what was that? What had happened was, All right, so what had happened like a year was. ago, like a year ago, Jared was telling me about the crank trigger wheel mod and with the keyway. So with the whole build process going on, it kind of fell through the cracks. And then about, what, about a month ago? I was watching PFI Speed, so shout out to Brent for reminding me on this, but um, they were putting their K-Series together and they were doing the crank uh, trigger keyway mod. And then I asked Jared if we had did it to this motor and he was like, yeah, I told you about it, but we didn't end <laughs> up doing it. So once we ordered the dog box, the engine only had two mounts in it. So we figured now was the time to do it, disconnected the lines. Uh, Jared and Barton dropped the motor and got it all done, got everything retimed. It got the new Skunk 2 billet two piece timing cover on there. Ooh, looking nice. Fancy. And then uh, we got the dog box on the table with the wave track diff. Oh, and, but uh, we got to look at your, your core that you built. Yeah. We didn't see that either. Kind of. How's that? Oh, there it is. There. You can see that monster. Thing is big. It's a big bell core. And really then uh, we custom made everything, had it powder coated here. You know, last time we seen this car, he didn't have his dash in. So now he's got his dash with his race pack, shifter, staging brake, all that stuff's in there. Jared did uh, all the work. <laughs> Thanks. Come on, Jared. <laughs> what else we got? Well, then I think last time too on Ryan's channel. Um, he showed off the staging brake oh, lines yeah. and everything done. Hydraulics are all done, brakes bled. Yeah. Custom Fregel uh, clutch lines so that way we don't have to run all those adapters in the back and then it's banjoed off of the master. Um, all one piece lined it back with only a single fitting. So then that's all done. Everything else I think they've seen uh, from before. So that's all that's there for today. Ow! Got the fingers. That's all right. <laughs> I only need the right hand. Don't worry, we got some of this stuff for you when you're uh, yeah when you're hurting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Make sure you have plenty of this when you're building a, an MR2. Yeah. And then we can go over to the dog box. Oh, we'll let's go see the dog box. Check that out. Done. This Done. is where you do that editing program where we all go. <laughs> okay. All the goods right here. Oh shoot. So just so your viewers know, this is a. Uh, just an anti-corrosion inhibitor. Nice. Um, but, uh, no, it's not graph and it's not PPG. So it is uh, custom keep and on it guessing. is huge. So that'll be teamed up with an all new uh, Synchrotech bearing kit from HPT Autosport. Uh, wave track diff over there. Uh, final drive, bunch of the Speed Factory goodies with the detent springs and the billet shift selector. And the magician over here will be installing it all here in the next week. Maybe tonight? No. <laughs> yeah, I wish. I wish. You better go so we can do it. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a, a pretty exciting next couple weeks. Uh, we've taken a bunch of steps back, but just to take a bunch of steps forward. So Good steps back. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Very good steps back. It's going to be an exciting build. Ready to check out the MR2? Yeah, let's go look at it, man. Are you ready to check out the MR2? Oh yeah, that I am. Look at that cage. Look at that. 
These guys work night and day to get this thing done. Have them keep the that, nights just blended into the day. Keep that NHRA stand. Just to get that bad boy right there. Now you got your YouTube lingo on. There, there you go. go. Peep that stick. Peep it. Dun dun dun. Look at that downpipe gleaming. Oh, here it is. Sun. Look at that. All right, Ryan. Let the people know. I have no idea who built this. Who built it? You know you can. Yeah. Right on, on the spot, let's go. Some tater built it. <laughs> yes. Let's get, let's get the details. All right, well, this is, as far as we understand, this is the first custom J35 SW20 MR2 in the world. Um, so one thing that I wanted to do was keep everything completely functional, and no matter what turbocharger you use, um, it's fully supported, and uh, thanks to Jared's teamwork, it's got a full chrome ollie, support system on there so no matter what unit you use it's going to be fully supported um, you don't even have to cut the tabs on the back wall um, everything keeps super super tight to the motor on that front bank back there i don't know brian if you can zoom into any of that back there i'm sure once you get the car up in the air you can you can take some more shots of that yeah um but everything hugs on uh underneath um, this kit is only compatible with the full J-Series swap. So if you have a K-Swap trans, this isn't going to work because the crossover pipe has to go underneath the oil pan where the starter would go on a K-Series setup. So as long as you have a full J setup, this will totally work. Um, if you decide to buy one of these manifolds from me, um, it's $25.90 shipped, um, but you'll have to have the exhaust system made and the dump tubes uh, made yourself unless you choose to bring me the car like Brian did um, but uh, it's uh, like all my manifolds it's got a fully billet collector and I know it's kind of hard to see really good there but that's got uh, two inch primaries twin 44s on there um, like you guys have seen they all come with billet collectors on every single one of my manifolds we got a nice three and a half inch. Yeah, dual three and a dual. half. I think it's massive. I know it doesn't look that big on video, but it, it's big. Might be compensating for something. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> let's hope not. But everything is made to be functional. So there's plenty of room uh, between the tubing and the subframe, plenty of room to get to your V bands on both sides. Even if you get underneath the car, the V band on the uh, opposite side is really easy to get to, uh, no issues getting clearance on that. So the kit is fully, it's really functional, it's really, really well thought out. We Speaking got of which, put him on the spot. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, <laughs> and <laughs> you are. <laughs> Hell Beat. yeah, what's up, man? <laughs> this is the guy that helped out on the cage till, so much, till three in the morning. All, made it possible. What's up, V? What's going on, man? <laughs> so, did you enjoy yourself? <laughs> I bet this thing was a pain in the ass, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah it was fun. It was fun. Yep. Yeah. Teamwork makes the dream work. Man, man, you didn't even need a ratchet strap. He could have just bent the, bent the twos. <laughs> v, you don't even need to be here. You already got a shot out, but I'm glad you're here. I really appreciate it. Yeah, yep. There it is, fellas. Yeah, this was fun. All right, now get this thing out of here. Oh, we got some, uh, oh, I forgot about the, the cage here in the back. Mm -hmm. Can't really see it, but it's all right. Yeah. You got double support. That was the fun part. Yep, you're going, you got one from the harness bar and then one from the top of the cage oh, yeah. on both sides, obviously. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's hard to see. All right. Any last words? Um, Ryan, any last no, words? No, you, Jerry. <laughs> 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 What's up, man? What's up? No, no. Nothing, Jared? Oh, I'm just happy it's uh, done. Happy you get to get it back. And uh, can't wait to see more progress with it as uh, some time goes on here. Next couple months. Awesome. Well, as always, thanks to Ryan from RMS Fab. You're welcome. His Instagram is in the description. Thanks to Jared and V. Yep. Higher standards. Their Instagram. You have Instagram? Uh, no, not Instagram, right? Facebook? Uh, I do have Facebook and Instagram, yeah. 
but Instagram's just under my name. Okay, why don't you go ahead and tell them, <laughs> go ahead and tell them what it is. Go ahead. I'll add in this. Yeah. I'll add in the description, I, but you go ahead. I and rarely tell them. use it, Brian. <laughs> How about Facebook? Yeah, just yeah. higher standards. Uh, yeah, we do have a business Facebook page. Jared, uh, look, at <laughs> look at me. <laughs> oh All right, god. his link will be in the description. Oh my god! <laughs> Thank you guys. We'll see you in a couple weeks. Hell yeah! Bye. Later. See you guys. Say bye. <laughs> He's like, bye. He's like, why don't you say bye? <laughs>